Hello friends, I am your friend Tikshil Yadav with a new topic of science that is soil. In this lesson, we are going to study about the types of soil. First of all, what is soil? Soil is one of the main abiotic components of our biosphere which helps us in maintaining our life. It makes it helps the plant roots to penetrate in it and hold the plants. Yes, it is also a loose material on the uppermost or the uppermost layer of the crust of the earth. Now types of soil. On the first of all, any type of soil contains three types of particles: sand particles, clay particles, and silt particles. Silt particles. These are the smallest in size as compared to clay and sand particles clay particles these are slightly bigger than the silt particles but still they are smaller than the sand particles and at last at come there comes the sand particles these particles are the biggest in size as compared to the clay and silt particles now the types of soil the main three types of soil these are the main three types of soil Yes, these are made on the basis of the, depending on the type of particles and the amount of particles present in these types of soils. Now these types are sandy soil, clay soil and loamy soil. Let us study about them in detail. Sandy soil. The kind of soil that contains 70 to 80 percent sand particles is known as sandy soil. It contains very less amount of silt and clay particles. As the sand particles being very large, they cannot put together or come together even by the force, intramolecular force. But that is why they have they have large spaces in between them in which they capture air. But they do, but the sandy soil, due to the presence of sand particles, cannot hold water. It is light, well aerated, and dry. It is not suitable for agriculture anymore. It is found in desert areas. Now the second type is clay soil. This is the soil that contains more clay particles as compared to the sand and silt particles. The clay particles being small, smaller than the sandy particles can hold more water, can hold much more water than the sandy part, sand particles and that is why clay soil is fit for crops like paddy. It, contain, it can hold water for long time and paddy is a crop that needs water for a very long time and too much water. It can hold more water, much water for paddy and for even for a long time. That is, it is fit for paddy. It is also used in making toys, trucks, small toys which are made of clay, pots, etc. And at last comes the third type that is loamy soil. The loamy soil, it is, it has every kind of particle, sand, clay and silt in proportion. It contains humus which makes it fertile. Due to the presence of clay particles, it can hold water and even due to the presence of sand particles, it can even hold air. That is why it is even well aerated, it can hold water and it is also fertile due to the presence of humus. Crops, crops like wheat, barley, maize, cotton can be grown in this pulses and even vegetables and fruits can be grown in loamy soil. It is the soil that is fit, fit for almost every kind of crop. So thank you friends for watching this video. Please subscribe my YouTube channel, like and share this video. Thank you. Jai Hind.